morning everybody and it's Tuesday of this day in Holy Week and today marks the day that Jesus went into the temple to teach. As you can remember yesterday Pastor Jason talked about uh, talked about Jesus cursing the fig tree on Monday. And then he went in and he cleansed the temple of all the peddlers and the sellers and the fig tree is going to play a part in today's message so let me get right into the scripture. We're going to read Mark chapter 11 starting at verse 20 to see what Jesus did on this Tuesday of Holy Week. In the morning, as they went along, they saw a fig tree withered from the roots. Peter remembered and said to Jesus, Rabbi, look, the fig tree you cursed has withered. Have faith in God, Jesus answered. Truly I tell you, if anyone says to this mountain, go throw yourself into the sea, and does not doubt in their heart, but believes with what they say will happen, it will be done for them. Therefore I tell you, whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it, and it will be yours. And when you stand praying, if you hold anything against anyone, forgive them, so that your Father in heaven may forgive you and your sins. So they arrived again in Jerusalem, and while Jesus was walking in the temple courts, the chief priests and the teachers of the law and the elders came to him. By what authority are you doing these things? They asked. And who gave you authority to do this? Jesus replied, I will ask you one question. Answer me, and I will tell you what authority I am doing these things. John's baptism. Was it from heaven or of human origin? Tell me. They discussed it among themselves and said, if we say from heaven, he will ask, then why didn't you believe him? But if we say of human origin, they feared, for th they feared the people, for everyone held that John really was a prophet. So they answered Jesus, we don't know. Jesus said, neither will I tell you by what authority I am doing these things. And then Jesus goes on after this and he he tells a multitude of parables to the people in the temple. And the people are starting to believe him. And they're believing that he is the Messiah. And they're believing that this man teaches like nobody else. And then they retreat, and Jesus and his disciples go off to the Mount of Olives for the evening. And then tomorrow we'll pick up from the story from there. But from yesterday, from Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, which is today, we can see that Jesus is setting up what's going to happen during this Holy Week. The table's set, everything's ready, and let's see what happens throughout the rest of the week. Thank you for joining us. We love you. We miss you. We'll see you soon.